hello, hello. It's me, Professor Nathalie for Visual Art. I know that you are in your house right now and so boring and maybe you have played all your video games, but don't you worry, we're going to do some art here. Let's take a look. Today, we're going to do an extra special sea landscape, but we're going to mix two different techniques. I know that you can do that. Okay, first of all, I'm going to trace or draw something here. Um, well, I don't know. It could be maybe a starfish like this. Remember, starfish always do these dots. There are encounter in the center of that. One starfish. Another giant starfish. I don't have enough space, so I can continue that. Don't you worry about that. Let's trace some circles there. Tiny circles. For makeup. line over here we're going to finish it in another star why not and here the sea another starfish here it's all about the starfish today use your imagination it that could be stars, it could be another thing, I don't know, a fish, or waves in the sea. Use your imagination. And I'm going to use those. Take a look, this is very, very special. My marker. But first, I'm going to take a white crayon. Son of you say, Professor, what crayons is useless? I say, of course not. You don't know how to use that. That's pretty different. Look, I'm sealing the waves with white crayon. On this side, maybe on that side. Maybe you're not seeing that. But when you're doing it, you're going to see that. Hello, how are you? Fine, okay. Hey, get off my camera. Let's have my child see down something. Get out. Okay. So I'm going to put a little bit of bubbles here. Yeah. And waves. Why not? Here. I'm going to now use my marker remember that when you're using markers trace always line don't do blah 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 because you're going to yeah lines 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 line 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 Remember, your professor do it quickly because he has experience. When you're doing it, take your time. <laughs> I really like this tone of blue. What's your favorite color? <coughs> Let me know. Okay, we have put it. In. Those stars, we're going to... <coughs> we're going to color it with crayons. I really like these crayons. Uh, they're sold in the Miniso and they're pretty good. They have a very, very crazy colors. Look at this, so bright. I'm going to use these colors because they're so intense. I really love intense colors. 
Yeah, we have it. Maybe that. And then I'm going to color it. Remember, first I'm tracing and then I'm coloring. Underlining, coloring. I can use different kind of colors. Professor, it could be with color pencils. Well, yeah, I don't see why you shouldn't, but the effects are going to be very more different. So, if you're following instructions, you can make a very, very great result. I'm going to make this lining. Look, beautiful. And then I'm going to color it. It's very, very important for you to feel all your drawing with this. I'm going to save my crayons and we're going to do some magic here. I'm going to take water, just water, and I'm going to spread the water on my sky. I want you to know how the water is opening the marker doing um, some wet effect. Don't do this because you don't going to take the same effect and get out of here please. Okay. Bye bye. Bye. I'm going to spread some water here with a technique that you already know. Some blue. Oh, but what happened here? What is not coloring? Why is not coloring? Oh, because of course crayon is made of wax and wax repels water. Lucky to me. I'm going to add more and more colors here. Why not? I'm going to put a little bit more color. It doesn't matter if you get into the star. The star is not going to absorb the paint. That's a very dry star. I'm going to put a little bit of purple there. Yeah, look at this. I really love it. Imagination is the key. I know that you're so artistic, guys. I have so you made a lot of things that I said, oh my god, you have done it? Here. Some dots here. If I wanted to be more concentrated color, it doesn't matter. You can. Try not to mix color that are in different tones. If I using blue, you can use just blue, maybe green, I don't know. And here you go. We have it. We have finished. You have a lot of cereals. I'm going to name that Nico. Go, go away. Okay, bye bye. Well, thank you so much for watching. See you the next time. And remember, always do artistic things. Let's go and see.